right. It's it's leaders such as yourself that are doing the work of awakening people right now to the reality that, I mean, just things are broken and they're not being fixed because all they're doing is just preparing for how they're going to be in position of power after the collapse. But we need to have people like yourself, I believe, uh, take take the reins, take the steering wheel. And, and actually, and- you got the wrong guy. I'm not um, I'm, I'm not a leader, even though I was in the Marines, I've had my own business and, mm-hmm. you know, I'm doing this. I feel that I, I, I've always when I started this this truth, I started with this theory that everybody needs to listen to all and follow none. I think that the main problem that we have in humanity is that we don't take responsibility for our own actions and our own thoughts and our own power. We're constantly looking for somebody either to fight or to save us. But we never look in the mirror and see that the problem is not, you know, outside, it's inside. You know, we don't need to fight anybody other than ourselves. We don't need anybody to save us because no one can. Mm -hmm. So what I've been trying to do is to, to teach people about the trivium and leaderless resistance and the ability that they have to be honest with themselves, question everything, you know, don't, don't take anything for granted because chances are every single thing that you've ever been told is a lie to benefit some collective. The answer is in the opposite consciousness, not another collective fighting against another collective. That's why we get into this mess over and over again. That's what revolution means. It's a revolving uh, problem of of, uh, one group of um, highly manipulative psychopaths that overthrow another group of highly manipulative psychopaths. And the only way that they get control is to spread a lie down to the individual for us to sacrifice for them. Mm -hmm. We need to see that we need to walk away from all this. We need to stop uh, allowing uh, negative thoughts in our minds. Uh, stop dealing with negative people in our lives. Stop empowering the worst in society with every dollar that we spend, with every view that we watch, with everything that we do. We empower them. They don't control us. Right. 